What's up YouTube, DC Productions back with another tweak video. Today we're gonna take a look at Zen HTML. This tweak is really awesome. You can customize your lock screen, your home screen, and I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. So we're gonna go into a lock screen. This is currently how I have my lock scene set up. It looks like a glitched logo. So that's my lock screen. I got a glitched clock up there, 404, file not found. And then for this glitched app logo, that's actually my real wallpaper. All this text here is part of the Zen HTML. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how to set it up. Sorry about that, face ID. So I basically have two widgets enabled. One is the background live wallpaper widgets, the 404 not found. The other one is the clock widget. So you go on here, this is gonna show you how to center the 404 not found widget uh, i kind of off centered it to a position where i thought was the coolest um, but you can move it all around on this side it says error file not found so it's kind of cool next up we're going to go into the next one this one's called glitched it's basically just a clock with the time and the date and it looks pretty cool it looks like a basically a glitched clock that just sits there and animates. Um, I don't think there's any settings for that either. Oh, there is. You can use 24 hour day, high day, show seconds. You can choose the widget color. So that's pretty cool. I hit done on that. So basically when I go to my lock screen, that's what my lock screen looks like. It's pretty awesome. Pretty cool tweak. Uh, this basically just shows the layout. So this is my actual wallpaper right here. This is the overlay of Zen HTML, and these would be like your notifications. For my settings, I do have the regular clock disabled right here. So I hide it on all pages because I do not want the regular clock being shown. I want the glitch clock being shown. Other than that, Lock screen idle duration is 10 seconds. You can customize that, make it up to two minutes. Um, there's also an option to do it on your home screen. I have that one disabled. I noticed that if you have them both enabled, it kind of takes a hit on your battery life. So I'd rather just have it enabled on my lock screen and just leave my home screen disabled so that I can have longer battery life. But you can also do the same thing. There's a bunch of different wa live wallpapers that you can use. There's snow. You can make it snow on your home screen for the holidays. Uh, what else? Sliding hex. That's kind of cool. Just sits there and animates as your background. Um, I'm going to go ahead and also show you guys where to find all these cool animated backgrounds for your lock screen and your home screen. And I'm also going to show you the repo where you can download Zen HTML. All right, the repo where I found Zen HTML is right here in the package repo, https colon forward slash forward slash repo dot com. I will link that down in the description so you guys can add it to Cydia. All I did was search for Zen HTML after I added the repo. Now, in order to get the cool live wallpapers like the 404 not found, I installed Zen live wallpapers on top of Zen HTML. So when you go into your settings for Zen HTML, they will populate. So background widgets, add a widgets. Once you've installed both those tweaks, all of these wallpapers will populate and you can go ahead and customize how you want to set up your phone. Now there is tons more uh, wallpapers that you can download. I do have the matrix wallpaper on my other phone. Um, I will be showing that later on in a different video. But I really appreciate you guys for watching. Thumbs up if you like the video and subscribe if you want to see more awesome jailbreak tweaks. Thank you.